They're selling out ballparks across the country, and tonight, the Savannah Bananas are bringing their ridiculously fun brand of baseball to Chickasaw Bricktown Ballpark. People have been lined up around the stadium for hours, in fact, hoping to get in today. And we are joined live here at 5 o'clock by Dakota McFadden, a player who's been with the team for three years. And Dakota, thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Thank you for having me. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so anybody with social media, I think, kind of has an idea. They've seen a clip at some point of you guys and what you do. But for people who are completely unfamiliar with the Savannah Bananas, how do you even begin to describe what you guys do? Uh, it's unbelievable. Um, being able to go across the country this year and be able to impact so many people um, in this entire world. I mean, the millions of people watching on YouTube, every fan that shows up in every ballpark that we come in, they come from miles and miles away. Uh, a lot of times, a lot of countries away. I mean, we had a family from Dubai show up in Savannah to watch the Savannah Banana game. And I mean, just the impact that it shows of how much it reaches across uh, the entire world is, you know, it's unbelievable. I mean, it's, it's such a blessing. And being able to do all this, I mean, it, it's hard to put into words. It's just absolutely remarkable of what we just are able to do every single day. Well, Dakota, you guys are really, you found a little intersection between athlete and entertainer. For example, we don't have video of this, but I saw you get hit by a pitch and everybody ran out to check on you and then you started dancing. You did like the stinky leg. I mean, to be able to, I know yep, you didn't yep, grow yes, up playing did. Little League yes, and, and high school and college ball and said, you know what, one day I'm going to be doing that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I actually coached an 11U team back home, and uh, right after that at bat and right after I did that, I got a whole bunch of messages from the parents of the team and the kids. Um, and then I had one mom send me a video of one of the kids that I work with one-on-one -on -one do it as soon as he got hit, too. So it was absolutely <laughs> hilarious. Um, so being able to break out and be an entertainer and, and you know, be an athlete at the same time because, you know, you always want to compete and be a ball player first. But reminder of having that entertainment piece um, when it comes time to do it. Uh, it's hard to balance, but it's fun to balance as well. Well, you guys because do a you great don't, job. Um, yeah. Thank you. And, yeah. we, and it's easy to not get wrapped up in the game. Sure. No, I believe it. And there's a bunch well. of great rules. Savannah uh, Banana Ball, it's super fun. It's very family friendly. You guys are playing tonight and tomorrow down there downtown. That's all our time that we got for you right now, Dakota. But thanks so much. And uh, thanks so much for coming through Oklahoma. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Absolutely, Dakota. Take care.